Hey guys, it's Matt Johnson from SRS and in this short film I'm going to show you how to make a destructible object in the foundry. As you probably know if you've done any foundry authoring, there are no actual objects that you can shoot at to destroy. There's only enemies. Which limits what we can do with the stories to some degree. But I'll show you what I've done here. We've got a force field ahead. So we want to get into engineering there, but we can't. And your bridge officer comes up, tells you, damn, a force field, no control system. How can we get through? So then you can write a little bit of a story into it. A site scans. Says there is a mobile force field generator here, but it's cloaked. One moment I think I can... There! The systems are locked out. We need to destroy it to disable the force field. So your science officer has very kindly dropped the cloak on the uh, force field generator. You'll notice it's just a normal Federation console. It's actually also slightly embedded in the wall. And you'll notice it's also looking at me, which is somewhat unnerving, isn't it? But what you can do here is just shoot it. And you'll notice it moves. But it is mobile, so maybe it's on wheels. And then it blows up and your force field drops. And it will fade away. Yeah, it would be great if it didn't move, it would be great if it disappeared immediately. But you'll find out why that isn't the case in a minute. Let's go and see how I did that. Look at the map and see what we've got here. We've got the force field generator. And we've got a an invisible wall. And another invisible wall. Now remember I said it was slightly embedded in the wall. Could possibly pull it out slightly, but mm, I don't want it to move very much. And behind it we've got the force field. So it can't move backwards, it can't move forwards. Some of you probably already guessed what I've done here. Actual fact, it isn't a prop. Uh, I'm sorry, it isn't a um, an actual console prop. It is actually an enemy. And what it is, is one of the actors from a Mastiff squad. So I put the other actors out here. You can see it's this one, look. I put all the other actors out here, so they are outside the map. They will just die. And I left the one actor here. And all you do is change the costume. See, it says costume here. Change the costume to whatever you want. You could choose anything, really. Obviously, I wanted to have a, a Federation console, so I use this one. So now you've got one actor of a group of Mastiff Ensigns, so very easy to kill, even on Elite. Um, <clears throat> but it's dressed up as a Federation prop. Now, the invisible walls are here jammed right up to it at the side this one that's got no y coordinates just stick it in there that'll stop it moving this way can't move back way because it's jammed against the wall uh, and it can't move forward because there's another one here in front of it problem then is because there's an invisible wall in front of it you can't actually shoot it you can if you lower the wall down a little bit so you'll notice on this wall, I've lowered the Y coordinates minus 2. 2 meters, I assume that is, even though it says feet here. But it's a 1 by 4 by 4, so I think Cryptic are working in feet and meters. In any case, I've dropped it down by 2 meters. If you imagine it, the wall is now only covering the bottom part of the console which is enough to stop it 
moving forward. Without the wall, it did run towards you. Well, kind of slide across the floor towards you and try and eat you. Which doesn't look very realistic. With the wall, it can't go anywhere. It's kind of trapped. It can turn, and that's about all it can do. Um, and then, of course, the other thing that we've got there is um, an explosion. here which has a state uh, the state for the explosion is that it happens when we've completed this objective which is unlock or destroy the force field so let's just have a look at the story option to that what we did we went to engineering my bridge officer came told me that there was a force field there we've got to destroy it so what you do is task add a task to kill enemies Give it the description you want. Just unlock or destroy force field generator console. I'm just going to put destroy now. I was trying to do a interact with it, but it doesn't work properly. Select your, <clears throat> your massive squad. Even though there's more than one of them, there's only that one I left alive because the rest are outside in space, but they die anyway. <clears throat> Go back to the maps. So we've completed that objective. A little explosion goes off. It's just a small one, small explosion. We don't want anything stupidly big. Just a small puff of smoke. Um, and then you can uh, proceed. What I will do now is get rid of the invisible walls. So again, I'll go to states when, when the objective is complete. I need to move this up a little bit. There we go. Let's find the right one. Destroy force field generator. So that will get rid of that wall once that's done. Same with this one. Objective complete. Oh, now I can see them all. Okay, just let me check that other one. Make sure I've got it in the right. Oh, I did it in the wrong place. Look, I'm always doing this. I want it to be visible immediately and to disappear when I've destroyed the force field generator. There we go. <clears throat> so that will now work quite nicely. Ah, head to engineering. Okay, so I want to head to engineering. I can do that by selecting the appropriate reach marker block in the story. Load the mission. Okay, so <clears throat> got a force field here. Can't get through. And also, there's the visible wall. So let's see what bridge officer tells you that uh, got the force field. We need to lock out, we need to destroy it. Let's remove the cloak. Mission tracker says destroy force field generator console. So that's what I'll do. Do have to target it carefully when there's a visible wall in there. There we go. It's dead. And probably you'd run past it anyway before it disappears, so they're not even going to notice that. And now I can continue with the next bit. These units here energy drain AI control units are actually Borg. Uh, they're not activated at the moment but later they will be. So you can make some pretty intense fights with interesting looking props. Oh, these guys don't give up do they? Right. Uh, and these will, these are free to move around. But they're actually Captain 3 level Borgs. Um, and uh, 
are quite nasty. So have some fun with props. You can make them destructible. You can make them do some strange things. Uh, hopefully you'll find that uh, useful when you're making your own missions. This is uh, Matt Johnson, SRS. Thanks for watching.